quick vid on Kensington Road and why my gearing is wrong. So we've got Dan on the left, Hayden on the right. We're taking this pretty chill. Uh, so at the moment, the gearing I have is 36.28 and I'm at 50 cadence, 50 cadence at 9 k's an hour. Um, and so in Adelaide, they have a lot of steep climbs and they're very, they're very good fun to do, good care when opportunities are, uh, but the gear, the gears, you just need bigger gears than I, um, than what I have. Uh, so 36, 32, I think is probably all right. But if I were you, uh, I'd either get a compact. So a compact would, for me, 34, 32 would be good. Or if you don't want to buy a 34, 32 and you have a 36, 52, 36 on the front, I would recommend, so 52 teeth and 36 teeth, if you're not sure what I'm talking about. Sometimes some bikes, often when they're seen as like race bikes, which is sort of an irrelevant category, but they come with bigger gearing, which is sort of pointless. Uh, but if you don't want to change that, you can just get a long cage derailleur and then put a 34 cassette on, or if you buy a, um, a road link, uh, which basically increases the distance between your derailleur and the biggest chain, so this screws on to your uh, rear mech hanger. If you get one of those, uh, then you can um, fit a 34 cassette with a short cage, uh, and then you'll have gears to spin. So a 36, 34 is equivalent to a 34, 32. Uh, so that's probably enough, definitely enough for Adelaide. Obviously it depends on your fitness. Like for me, I can, uh, my FTP is about five watts per kilo. So for me, climbs have to be quite steep before I run out of gears. But obviously if you're less fit, then you probably need some easier gears, like a 34, 40 maybe. Uh, and obviously if you're stronger, then you get, get, some, get some harder gears if you think if you think you don't need it. In London, a 36, 28 is fine because we don't really have many steep climbs. And if they are steep, they don't go on for very long. Um, like there aren't many walls like this that you'd come across in London, but in Adelaide, like there are really steep hills, really steep hills. So really, really steep hills. <laughs> Some of them like are sort of 20% for a long time. Like here, look, it hasn't gone dip below 15% for a very long time. I'm doing up to six watts per kilo there. There's about five and a half and I, I'm struggling. So, I mean, if you, if you can't do five, six watts per kilo, uh, up a 12% gradient, then you definitely need, definitely need easy gearings than a 36, 28, like, like 100%. Uh, so we're coming towards the end of Kensington Road. Uh, it's a really nice climb, actually. Uh, KOM is about four minutes from Michael Valgren. His power data is a bit rubbish, but it's about six, six and a half, seven miles per kilo, probably for the KOM, I'd say, up here. Uh, I'll probably attempt it. Will I be able to get it? Depends. If I lose some weight, probably. Uh, but it's, a, it's a good climb, very steep at the end, so definitely needs gearing, so hopefully... When my 32 cassette starts working again, I'll be able to uh, be able to spin up this climb a bit faster. Obviously, if I was going full gas, we'd be going faster, I'd be close to 360 to 400. But nonetheless, it's good. And a, a top tip, a pro tip that Dan, who is a bit of a Strava addict, uh, if I don't, <laughs> I hope he doesn't mind me saying that, but he knows a lot about Strava. The KOM is just probably here, just before you get to the rocks. So you sort of need to, if you want to get the KOM, you need to push it relatively hard. Uh, and then this bit, you just roll up to the lookout and um, you get a really nice view on the right hand side of Adelaide. Uh, it's pretty, one of the best views I'd say. Mount Osman has a good view and obviously Lofty does, but Lofty are quite far away while these, I like sort of the lower the lower climbs where you're slightly close to the centre of the city. Um, but yeah, it's a good climb, check it out. Um, I'll try and leave the link to my ride in the description. And uh, cheers for watching and I'll see you in the next video, which should be Katusha, a ride with Katusha. All right.